near the forest. Whenever she went out, the little girl wore a red riding cloak. So everyone in the village called her the Little Red Riding Hood. Little Red Riding Hood, come here, sweetheart. Yes, Mom. It's been a while since you've seen your grandmother. I was thinking that you could go visit her today. Oh, yes, Mother. I would love to. That's a great idea. Here's the basket of goodies to bring to her, so off you go. Remember to go straight to Grandma's house. Don't get distracted along the way, and please don't talk to strangers. Don't worry, Mom. I'll be careful. So off she started her adventure to Grandma's house. Along the way, Little Red Riding Hood noticed some lovely flowers in the woods. She forgot her promise to Mother. She picked up a few flowers, watched the butterflies for a while, then picked up a few more flowers. Oh my, Little Red Riding Hood was so distracted that she didn't notice a dark shadow approaching out of the forest behind her. Suddenly, a wolf appeared beside her. What are you doing, little girl? I'm on my way to see my grandmother. Through the forest, near the creek. Hmm. I see. Oh, I'm late. I've got to get going. It was nice to meet you. So, the wolf took a shortcut. So he could get to Grandma's house. So 